All right, EA Sports, it's been a month and you have yet to patch this rewards glitch in Madden 25 Ultimate Team. So I'm going to expose it to the 214,000 people that are subscribed to me, which by the way, that is a crazy number. Thank you guys for the love. Now, Soul Soul Sif family and welcome back to another Madden 25 Ultimate Team video. Hope you're watching this one or having a wonderful start to your day. And without further ado, let's get it popping. Now, the rewards glitch we're going to be talking about in this game will allow you to get max rewards in this one event. Literally every single time you play it because of this glitch that's going on you cannot lose meaning you get the best rewards every time now what is the mode how do you do the glitch and should you guys be doing it let's talk about all that good stuff if we go on over to our head-to-head -head tab right here and we scroll to the champions game mode there is a glitch which has been going on in this mode for i want to say the entirety of madden 25 now the way this works is pretty simple if you get to the end of a champions game the game does not track say for example i go through here i play someone i beat them seven to three it's a crazy low score in game like the 1960s we're running the football we get to the end of the game we both click exit the game literally does not track to buy madden 25 coins for the cheapest price on the internet check out mmo exp by clicking the link in the description and use the promo code swift at checkout for five percent off so the only way that a champions game tracks is if one of the two opponents quits out of the game if someone quits out the game will track but if you make it to the end the game doesn't track so theoretically and this is super scummy but you could go through here and if you never quit out of a single champions game you will get the 16 win rewards every single time because say for example you play a game you're losing just get to the end of the game and the game will not track and you can literally just rack up wins by doing this over and over again if someone quits out you get the win if they don't quit out or if you lose and you get to the end of the game it just doesn't track and to be honest with you guys with it being a saturday there's actually no better time to do this because all of the good players right now are playing the gauntlet game mode but you can go through play champions where there's going to be less good competition because most most of the people that are really sweating are playing gauntlet you can go through kind of take advantage and start to play against some of those guys that a probably don't know this glitch and go through and will quit out of the game once you're up and b if you do run into a good player well you literally just stay in the game the whole time try and win it i mean maybe they'll quit out if you get a lead but if not you can go through and literally just stay in the game the whole way and the game will not track and this will literally guarantee that you get the 16 win rewards now i will say once you get to 16 wins there's no reason to keep playing these games you can quit out of each of them because 16 17 18 19 and 20 are all the exact same rewards and the 16 win rewards bro they're actually good you get 100k coins you get the mud champs bnd player fantasy pack and whichever card you pick from that quick sells for 100,000 coins so that's 200k right there and then you also get two touchdown packs which probably is another 100,000 coins in value for going through and winning 16 games you get about 300k those are probably the best online rewards in this game they're realistically better than head-to-head -head unless you go through and win a super bowl which we're trying to do right here in the playoffs they're probably better than head-to-head -head ranked as well and boy Boys, they are absolutely worth trying. Now, there's also one other set of rewards that I want to be sure you guys are prepared for in today's video. But before we do, the New Orleans Saints are looking to go 3-0 tomorrow. And we're looking to hit a couple more underdog fantasy picks. The picks I posted for you guys last Sunday were absolutely unreal. We hit every single pick except for one, hit three of our four slips, and made about $500 in winnings. Now, if you want to make some picks for Sunday football tomorrow, the place I'm making these on is called Underdog Fantasy. And I will leave it linked in the description. You can go through through, click that link to download the app if you want to try and make some picks and once you download the app put in the promo code swift that will get your first deposit matched up to one thousand dollars and you get two special lines number one cd lamb's line is set to 0.5 yards and number two caleb williams line is set to 0.5 yards as well all right now getting back on track let's talk about the other set of rewards that i want you guys prepared for number one i'm just going to open up a boomer bus fantasy pack in the background right here but i want to quickly talk about the team of the week tokens because boys with the overall bump happening a couple of days ago team Team of the week is also going to get bumped meaning our free team of the week player is also going to get bumped as we go through and pull an aka 82 chris johnson not a bad pull i believe the 82 overall akas are somewhat expensive damn it's the 83s that are not the 82s but like i was saying team of the week is getting bumped meaning we can go through and actually get a free bnd 85 overall player in a couple of days so if you guys go through here and go to your program team of the week you guys are going to see there's the team of the week set i've been getting a lot of people asking me swift if i do this set am i screwed for team of the year no these team of the week token exchanges they're totally different now as you guys can see there's an 83 overall bnd team of the week token there's an 84 overall bnd team of the week token fantasy pack and when we get the bump in a couple days there will also be an 85 meaning you can go through and get a free 85 which sometimes that's a free lineman sometimes that's a free kicker or punter that really helps you out now to get this just play your team of the week solos it is very very simple you get about two tokens per 
week. These team of the week tokens are the one that you use to get the free players. There's also team of the year tokens, which you get as you go through and play through these challenges. As you guys can see, when you play through the final challenge in each sequence, that's your team of the year token. Those are different than the team of the week tokens. I know some people have been asking me, okay, should I spend my team of the week tokens or do I save those for team of the year? No, you can spend the team of the week tokens. They're totally different and I would recommend you spend them actually. And realistically, the best time to actually spend them is when we get an overall bump because that's when these cards get bumped and that's when the 85 overall players that we get from the sets, well, they have the most value because over time, of course, the value of 85s is gonna go down as we get higher and higher players. So yeah, just a little suggestion, which I would strongly recommend you guys follow. It's pretty quick to do. The solos really only take you a couple of seconds and you're gonna get a pretty solid card. We'll see how good those cards are on Monday. If they're good enough, I'll probably make a video on them. If not, I'll just mention them in the video for sure. All right, now I've also gotten a couple of questions about these other free packs. People are asking me, okay, what should you open out of the rare option? What should you open out of the epic option? Boys, I would always say the move is the boom or bust pack right now with 72s, 73s, 74s, just not having much value. It's not worth going through and collecting a bunch of lower overall cards. Open up the boom or bust every single time. We're gonna get a legend pull right here. Who's it gonna be? 79 Charles Haley. That's not super good. But this to me is better than going through and selling off a bunch of like 76 overall pulls. That's just no fun. Selling those cards off for 1k over and over and over and over again. That's not really what you want to do. I'd recommend you open up the rare option. Let's open up these free packs we got right here before we go for this video. And hopefully you guys have all been having a wonderful weekend. Just want to quickly say as well, thank you guys so very much for the love on the channel. Like, bro, the fact I get to do this is my full-time job where I literally just play video games and make picks on the NFL. It's insane, bro. It's like a dream life right here. As we got an 81 Tyreek Stevenson, these team of the week cards actually sell for a little bit of coin because there's no team of the week pack. So we'll sell them off for 22 and we'll take that. We're getting close to 2 million coins. That's pretty good. Now we also have two 82 plus overall BND players. If we get an 88 from this, that would be absolutely zesty, beautiful, gorgeous. Let's see if we're able to do that. I'm not expecting we are. I haven't seen these packs be too crazy on Twitter, but we'll see if we can go kind of crazy right here. Card number one, the animation is just stunning. And the first card we're going to pull is an 82 Khalif Raymond. Quick sell that boy. All right, one more 82 plus overall pack before we go for this video and before we get some of those underdog wins tomorrow, which we absolutely love to see if the Saints win and we get our underdog wins tomorrow. Bro, I'm going to be going crazy over on Twitter. Final card of the video is going to be showing us. I don't think that's the big animation. It's an 82 Julius Brents. This card probably has good stats. I'm not going to lie. He had an insane card last year, was it? But yeah, we don't need them. Now that's going to do it for me. If you enjoyed today's video, drop a like, hit that sub button if you are new. And until next time, I'm out. Love y'all. See you in my stream. Peace. So, 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 so.